Hello Year 3 and welcome to your third design and technology lesson this week but before we get into our lesson I just wanted to have a little chat with you so it was really nice to see you all this morning and it was really lovely to hear you share all of your invention ideas so we had some fabulous ideas we had Jessica say that she'd like to make a robot that reminds you things when you forget them which is what Mrs Mirza actually really needs okay um then Leia said that she would love to design a pen that never runs out. Yeah. Then Akash said he would love to design a machine that does your work for you. So we had some fantastic ideas, some fantastic invention ideas, and I'm really excited for you to continue to um for you to continue completing your workbooks that you have made at home, and then just seeing these inventions over the next few weeks. All right. So your learning objective today is can I research and evaluate other inventions to help me with designing my own? So we're going to look at some Victorian inventions um, from the past. We're going to research them. So look into them, you know, see what they're about and then discuss um, what's nice about them, what isn't nice about them to help us make our own. So now, Let's do this together. So this is Dr. George Scott, the man who made the um, electric hairbrush. Okay, so now um, let's see what he's saying. So on his on this little section, it's saying we will now be researching and evaluating other products. You may find something in these products that you want to use in your own in your own product. So make a note of it. Let's start with my electric hairbrush. What do you think of it? So now if you look, at, let's do this one together. Let's have a look at these questions here and evaluate this product, okay? Evaluate this hairbrush. So if you just pause the video now and go grab yourself a pen and a paper so we can do this together. Fantastic. So now it says, what is this? So this is an electric, let's fill this in together. So I'm just going to change the size of the writing for you. So question one says, what is this? This is an electric hairbrush, okay? The next question says, what is it for? So does, does anyone remember what it was for? Fabulous, so it was to cure boldness and make hair thick and strong. Next question is, who do you think it is for? So if you refer back to your text map and in this question, yeah, try and remember who it was for. Fantastic. So now the next question is, what do you think it's made from? Do you remember what it's made from? Yeah, I do. But what I'd like you to do is have a look at your text map. So pause the video here, have a look at your text map and see what it is made from. What, what was it made from? So I'd like you to do some research and research into your text map. OK, fantastic. So it was made from it was um, made from metal. Yeah, because it had in it was made from metal. Like you can see if you look at this picture, you can see it's made from metal. But if you'd like to research more into it, you're more than welcome to. OK, so the next question says, what features from this invention would you like to use in your own design? So if I was to design this electric hairbrush, the thing that I like to keep the same is the um, engraving. I love the fact that this electric brush, electric brush has engraving in it because it makes it more personal and sentimental. So you can actually give it to someone as a present because engraving has basically a message on it. Yeah. And is there anything you would like to make this invention better? How would you like to make this invention better? The way I would like to make this invention better is by making it a different material. I'd prefer it to be plastic. Yeah. Fabulous. So what I would like you to do now is over here, it says your task is I want you to research and evaluate these two products using the same sheet as before. So this sheet that we filled in here, I've shown you an example over here of it. And these two are 
um, Victorian inventions. And what I would like you to do is, I would like you to evaluate and research these two Victorian inventions. So this is the um, bicycle, yeah? And this is the Victorian camera. All right, fantastic. Good luck, year three. And make sure you remember to upload your work onto Tapestry. Fantastic. Bye.